as you can see all the files have been copied and you can successfully uh, boot from the usb yo what's up everybody my name is Haytham and you're watching geekblogging.com so in today's video i'm going to show you how to create a bootable usb flash drive uh, for windows or linux so before we begin if you want to see more videos like this be sure to smash the like button down below and with those being said let's get started for fresh content subscribe press the bell icon to never miss an update from geekblogging.com don't forget to follow me on instagram too so first of all download the software we're using today on this tutorial it is called rufus you will find on the link in the description box or by clicking the card that is popping up right now make sure to download the portable version and then open it you will find uh, this uh, interface so first of all plug in your usb drive i must notice you that it have to be at least over uh, 8 gigabytes so mine is 16 i think it is pretty good then for boot selection you have to select the disk or iso image so if you don't have one yet you can go to my previous tutorial where i explained about a software that uh, gives you the possibility to download all versions of Microsoft Office and Windows. The interface uh, you can you can check it out in the link that I will leave in the in the description box or in the card that is popping up right now. Here you have all the Windows versions, versions, Office and others and settings. You can go here, for example, for Windows 10. So. You can select the editions right here based on the updates. Go with the Home Pro, click on Confirm. Then you can choose the language. Let's see. Click on Confirm to. And here you can choose the versions between 32 and 64 bits. Go in with the 64. And here, here the file download it so just click open or save and download it will start now let's go back to our software right here now after you download the iso image file you have to select it i have mine on the desktop this is the for the windows 7 and uh, leave other uh, the settings by default and just click on start Click on OK since it warns you that it will uh, format the USB. Just click on OK and wait for the process to complete. Now that the software has ended, you can just close it and head to the PC. As you can see, all the, file, all the files have been copied and you can successfully boot and uh, boot from the USB. This is it guys, if you want me to continue providing you with the best tutorials in a weekly basics, show me your love and support by clicking the like button, subscribe, want notifications on and share this video with your friends. Peace out.